Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be updating your iPad to the latest iOS. So let's just go right into your settings. Under your settings, you guys will see the very first option where you guys will read your name. Right there, it's iCloud. You guys can make your backup right there. If you guys have no space on your iCloud, like nobody does with 5 gigs anymore, just hook it up to your computer and use iTunes. iTunes is a free program for both Mac and PC. You guys can back up your iPad right there if you like. Anyways, let's get down to this. Your second option right here under general will be software update. Let's just tap right there and you guys will see this. This is the latest update from Apple. We can download and install, so let's just tap right there. It's gonna ask us for a passcode if you guys have one. So the first thing it's gonna do, it's gonna start downloading. During the downloading process, if your iPad turns off by itself or something like that, you run out of battery, no big deal. You guys can just restart the download again. However, if during the installation process, your iPad turns off, it is a big deal. Cause then you might have to restore it because something will go wrong, okay? So even if you guys have 100% of your battery, I highly recommend having hooked up to some electricity while this is happening. How long will this take? Well. For most of you, it's gonna take about 10 minutes maximum. That's the downloading time plus the installation. However, if you guys have an older generation iPad and your internet speed's really slow, sure, this could take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. It really does depend on your internet speed. It's not a huge update. However, you guys do need some space. And remember, if you guys have your storage maxed out in your iPad, it's gonna run slower and slower. So always have a couple gigs left over just so it can run smoothly. Anyways guys, what it's gonna ask me later on is to install, if I can install it right now, I can just let this run by itself and it will install by itself or it's gonna ask you to restart your iPad right away during the installation process. So just let it be, let it run, let it do its thing. What we're gonna see is an Apple logo, a loading bar, and then it's gonna do that, restart, and then it's done. You guys are gonna have the most updated thing right here will be News Plus, which enables you to actually subscribe into a ton of magazines. So with one subscription with $9.99, you guys will be able to subscribe to a ton of magazines. It's like 300 magazines that you guys are gonna be able to download and read on your iPad for now, which is something that Apple was missing for sure. All right guys, so that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.